Hey there on the SoCal playing VLDC X. Whoa, my voice might get muffled a little bit. I don't know. Here we go. Roberto Zampari with Dark Cloud Castle. That's what we're doing. Change below everything that matters about the universe. Ooh, everything's all like stone colored. There we go. Let's petrify Yoshi's Island and end up in a wooden house. <laughs> That's how it goes. All right, skeleton. Yeah, that's right. Mold with blocks? Sure, man. This is this block? Yeah, that's right. You gotta solve this puzzle in order to eat this cake. Here we go, cake town, math town. Put some grass on that math. Look at that, Rex. It's so self-important. Get out of here, mega mold, please. Wall pencil, case, and friends. Uh, in the basement of the end. Here we go. Mushroom turning around using a magic spell. We got Mega Man music. That's fine. Put an X on it. Here we go. We got plastic block leading us to the end of the crowd. Look at that. We see it's dark clouds. There's dark clouds out. It's a storm outside in the video game world. Alright, so this is a mole puzzle, as we call it. Because it's not a puzzle. <laughs> but we don't like to use that word. What an awkward jump this is being. Like, you need. Ah, uh, yeah, you need, like, just a little bit of a running start. Just enough to be annoying. But then Nick can knock. Uh oh, we're adding lava. Making, you know, dark things less dark. With this affluence of light being shone upon. The universe on here we go look at that i'm running on these yellow blocks like they were made of tofu made for my feet feet food here we go give me fire give me dreams oh that guy has tripped a little bit on the corner that's horrible must be his first day on a job or something oh man oh whoa a fireball uh that could have gone places it's, it's this guy you throw he spits fire from his stony throat he has a cold he has the hiccups Everything you could ever wish for. I tripped on my jump. Good time. That guy's was watching. Whoa. That fire protected that Rex. I hope he's aware how lucky he is to have such a powerful guardian angel looking upon him. Rewarded for conserving my massive size. Oh boy. Now we get into the dark part of the dark castle. Here we go. Everything is brown though now. It's a bit less, uh, it's a bit less on brand. Unless brown is a brand. I mean, some of them do. Like, there's that one box company, delivery company. Then I got hurt in a dumb way. That's my brand. <laughs> I don't like that brand, but I'm stuck with it. So I don't know if I'm missing things in the dark. Because I don't want to look. This is its darkness gimmick, man. Ninjis are having fun. So, whoops, well, see there, I was looking below, I wasn't looking where I was, and that's what happens when you don't look where you yourself are. You trip up, you make a silly mistake, and then you die forever. Well, you get, you lose half your mass, which, in reality, would be pretty deadly. For Mario, though, he, he doesn't really notice all that much. Alright, bread, bread online, bread online, here we go, video game. Everyone is having fun in the pyramid of schemes. You can get a mushroom. It looked like it was behind the windows for a, a second. That's right, ducking isn't enough. Dang it. Oh, that's a unfortunate life loss there. Well, not life. Again, it's just a hit. Why am I being so dramatic? Oh, what? Oh, don't kidnap me like that, please. I have many bread-based opinions. I'm gonna run into this guy. That's right, I did that. So... There's something going on here. I don't have a yellow switch palace. That's fine. I can go inside a door. This is the bonus pool room to get the last dragon coin of legends. Are you willing to eat sarsaparilla? Oh, yeah, it's actually pretty easy. You just go here. I did it. I solved that puzzle. <laughs> just go to the very end and ignore most of the setup. That's why you're here, but ain't nothing I can do here. I don't know where Secret Exit is. Oh, it's Roy. Sure! There's probably a door somewhere. I don't particularly feel inclined. I apologize, but I did explain. I'm the start of this project. Hey, man. I'm doing what I want. 
And that's, that's about all there is to it. This one was pretty nice. I feel like the darkness gimmick just doesn't really do a whole lot. Like, I feel like that section there, you could just not have the darkness and the level would be mostly unchanged. Except you wouldn't have that annoyance that comes with darkness. Like, it's just a weird decision on me. Maybe, uh, considering, like, this level was pretty nice, but got 68th place, so I wonder if that could be because of the secret. Which is why I'm just gonna keep on moving on. Colossus Autonomous is an amazing name. And Robar R R Roberto Zampari is the person who made it. I tripped so much on your name and I don't even know why. It's just a name. Once again, secret exit. Don't know what it means. Got Donkey Kong. Co Whoa. Whoa, what an awesome map. Space Castle in the peachy skies here. All right, well, I'm... This is vanilla? Really? Okay. So we're at this stage of the contest, it looks like. Like, honestly, I've seen plenty of chocolate level design submissions with access to all of the chocolate level design tools make graphics that are less... Okay, that's solid. Got it. That are less like just eye popping and just like so different looking. Right, this block ain't. Is, is, is it blocked with eyes? Little eye, little slits. It ain't. It ain't no eyeball, man. More bread on lines. Here we go. Pick a direction. Don't get bop. You can bop if you want. Look at that. Replace a line with like pure machinery. No, seriously, this doesn't feel vanilla. It. it, it, it this is... this is nonsense. Okay, well, I mean... Let's enjoy the game. <laughs> Look at that. I went a whole detour for a Dagadon. Oh, this is this is a level with a big time limit. So possibly get worried if you want to. You're not forced to. But getting worried is just so much fun. Those pipes are solid. Bought my head on them before. This feels like maybe progress is here, so let's check out here real quick. Look at that. Extra power up for me. I will use it every day until I lose it invariably. Look at this little side path though. Oh, now I don't know which one's the side path. Well, let's go in this pipe. Let's just go. Here we go with another place in time. Look at this window. <laughs> this looks amazing. Yeah, I'm finding this sweet little turret room here. This is great. Oh shoot, well, you know what? I can return to the turret room, which now that I think about it is pretty appropriate, and I can refuel my firepower here. That's right, each of these fire flower are loaded into a cannon, and that's how you launch like big giant blast of fire at your enemy. Wow, we out, we just walked into that swim. I'm, I won't go back to refuel. I just walked into that guy like an idiot. I was like, you know what? Maybe if I show no fear, he will show fear. Is that a pipe? No, that's a torpedo head launch. Got it. Like here, where do I want to go? Oh, this is splitting up into pieces. This is a place that feels very threatening to fully explore because I feel like I didn't go on five different paths already somehow. Expect the worst. All right, so here we go. Nets. Yeah. I don't know why. Three years ago, the time of VIP 6 and of this thing, people were way into nets and climbables. And oh, okay. At some point, find a P switch. You can run up there. There's a triangle down there. So that explains that. Is the P switch here? Maybe. Oh, that's fire power. Oh, no. Glad to take that. But, uh, yeah, so, there's a secret exit, I assume that be it, good thing I'm not too interested, maybe not a little bit, no! Okay, so, there you go, punch that guy in the face, and go there, see, no, maybe not, I think, like, it's just like an alternate path, because I feel like that would just meet up back here. Alright, well, let's go on this pipe, go through time and space. And investigate. Is there something down there? Well, maybe. Okay, so let's go on. S oh, that's confusing. Okay, but it's very much on purpose. 
Oh, that is so cool! Those little wrestle statues just juggling that sable around. <laughs> That's it! This is one of my favorite things! Wow, okay. How would you do that? Uh, there you go. Ted, right? And that's just a guy. Oh, that's a dip. There you go. I was wondering about that construct. Like, okay, I could have jumped there, and something might have happened. Well, I am still curious, but now I can't do anything. If my bread was caught by a vicious bread eater, what am I going to do now? Hey, guys, let's play kickball shell. There we go. Blitz it up in old school style. Oh, I almost fell there. Ah, please die. Here and so I will. Look at that double feather, yes siree. There's an escalation of power-ups that I appreciate. Um, is my memory correct that we've been playing for a while now? Like I'm not feeling like scared or anything. Still, oh there we go. Yeah, midpoint. I was wondering about that because like this started at what 600 about time 550. Well, we're like halfway through. We got green things. The music changed. This guy's here. He's having fun. Well, you can have fun. Just got. I yeah. I I panic and I, I I jump when I saw the thing sticking in front of me. But there was nothing to fear yet. Maintenance note. Oh boy, direct contact with fuel can be deadly. Okay, so that's fuel. Got it. Oh shoot, it's green energy. You get it? Cause it's green. Yeah, no one has ever made that joke before. <laughs> oh boy. You know what? A level based around weird line guides is pretty nachos. I'm gonna go ahead and say it. Uh, yeah, I would rather have something that helps me with jumps in the context where the level's gonna get silly with jumps. There you go. Just hitch a ride on a permaglide. That's my old never say. I can't tell. Okay, there we go. Okay, and that's... Yeah, that not get solid. Oh, there's a box there. Well, you know, if you're interested in boxes, get a job at Fisher Price. I don't know why. So this is like an alternate path or something. Uh, can I go down here? Yes, I can. So these are just Charlies, really. That's just that guy, you know. He's, he has a job. And I have a job, too. Everyone has jobs. I don't know what's happening here, really. Like, what are we doing? I saw the blue blog, and I was like, well, that's kind of a little bit alternate. That's a fanzine. Let's check it out. Oh, I'm running out of time now. Like, I want to take my time while I check this out, because it's a, it's a little risky. But the game doesn't want me, so there's a mushroom I've missed, and uh, I might die here. <laughs> what an awkward little moment. Well, I got a mushroom back. That's a good news. The level player probably expected you to have died, uh, because, yeah, uh, time is running low. Alright, well, okay, you know what? I'm gonna do it this way. It's not gonna work. Dude, there's probably a power-up here, and I need it. There you go, thank you. I got 60 Mario time units left. Let's just hold down. You can slide kill a disco. Well, not a disco. Well, I don't know, maybe I'm not paying attention to the universe around me. What is this? All right, well, uh, yeah. Oh. This was a sweet detour for Sweet Dagadon. The second one, the second one I've collected. Everything in the world makes so much sense now. Um, yeah, I can't tell if, um, I am late or, like, if I just did something terribly wrong or, you know what? Let's just go where the coins are at. Where do I go from here? Okay, coins are going here now. Four! I'm at four! Is this it? Is this just the end? Four, three, two... I found the key, but like, I died of timeout. Like, is that normal? Did you expect the player to die at the hand of, well, like, past the midpoint? Cause yeah! I spent a whole 600 Mario time unit here, and I don't feel like I was particularly time inefficient. You gotta be careful about these things, you know? Like, it always feels bad. Like, I... You know what? Maybe by your standards, I did dawdle. Uh, in which case... Fair? But, like, I mean, you're... In which case, I would say... Your standards are pretty elevated. Uh 
having trouble landing here. There we go. Cause I keep thinking it's gonna do a full uh, circle, but it doesn't. All right. Well, I mean, this time at that place where I picked up a blue block to go down, instead I'll go up. As it looked like the path was different in that direction. Uh, we're gonna try that out and, and see what happens. Uh, now there is like, is there Colossus in the level of the name of the snow? Yeah, Colossus Autonomous. See, so here instead of going down, we're gonna go up. And uh, we're gonna see what happens with that. So at the very least, we'll be exploring like a different level. Or at least like a level, like, you know, same level instruction. But, what? Oh. How did, yeah, yeah, okay, that's, yeah, awesome use of my everything. Can you go up there? Like, what? What do you want from the player here? I cannot tell. Also, you, you chuck two of them. Are you, is there two of you there? Alright, you can just go here and then bombs fall on your head and that's great. Great feeling. Alright. 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 Things are just falling everywhere. That's just what this level is about now. So take your time. Make sure to look ahead. There's an actual lack to. Wait, what do I do from here? Well, there's a mushroom coming over, but... Like, can I climb these? I can't climb these. Is there... What am I doing here? What am I supposed to do? Was I supposed to bring a blue block and bop the Lakitu and ride it up? Maybe... Oh, that's why there's bombs and stuff. I can use the bombs to kill the Lakitu and steal its style and goes up. Okay. Got it. Then... Uh, you can't really hurry up here. So yeah, you're just gonna have to wait for bombs to end your way. But like, this is just me or just get like real saturated real quick. Okay, but it worked. Alright, let's follow the coin still. Oh, these are generated, so like, the game don't care. Well, they could be placed, honestly. They could. Alright, back into the machine. Look at that, we got a sweet safety door here. Da -da -da. No, we're still in the ship. I don't think we're done. Maybe, well, I mean, you're giving me a power up right here, and yet another already pipe. It, this was just the uh, in between zone. What is happening anymore? Right, so we still got more people heaving platforms around. Uh, this is like a hard mode of what we've just encountered, really, at the start of the level. But yeah, this is still going strong. <laughs> There's a lot of level going on here. All right, so finally, okay, so and yeah, and they're gonna juggle their saws, and it's super rad. Like, mm, that is super rad. Like, I love it. We got a little ease for hands. I swim. You're excited to be here. Well, I'm excited to, ooh, to look at this jump and go like, okay, and just do that. Finally. All right, I'm gonna kill a mushroom. That I mistook for turtle. Here we get a thing, get another door, yet another cape. Very, very generous with power-ups. Got Sonic, so I know it's a good time. Let me just do this real quick. Okay, so the water... When I got hurt, I thought it'd be hurt water somehow, but then here it killed me instantly. Like, without... Well, like, not instantly, but it ignored my invincibility frame, so... Okay, like, we saw what that's about. Let's return in the lower path and see, like, what else there was left to explore. But here instead, I just get overwhelmed by his spinies, taking up literally all of space. Uh. Look at that. Uh, really? I mean, yeah. But like, I keep falling, like, you need to watch out when giving big drops with an enemy or anything that can hurt you at the bottom. Oh, a thrilling concept, indeed. So yeah, so there's a key, there's a moon up there. If I had, like, oh, wait, I landed on something for a second. Yeah! Or not, it's just a camera being, hey, check it. North Skydeck, East Engine Room, South Fuel Tank. Alright, I'll... Skydeck? Sure. Look, I'm, I'm not gonna take one path, and if it works out, it works out. Oh, this is the Yoda Scroll path. Got it. Skydeck. I mean, makes sense. And we 
got this music here, you know, some Zelda, some Dark World. Oh, you know, Dark Cloud World Castle was the previous level, wasn't this, this giant gun? Like, I love it. Oh, hey. Woo! With layers, huh? Okay, that's interesting. Alright. Everyone's just shooting randomly everywhere. It's not really amounting to a whole lot. <laughs> Pearl is a good jumper though. Oh, this is... No, yeah, with the addition of layers? This is interesting. Ah, oh, shoot. Well, I just got stuck in a hodgepodge country. We've got bull and cycling the drain. I want that mushroom so I can feel more pain. So the hazard blocks are gonna move with the layers. Oh, yeah, this is... Keeps... Oh, shoot, I messed up. No, yeah, this is not... I don't... This might not be Butter Bridge, but, uh, Cave Zone. Cave Zone Caveman. Caveman. Town. And friends. Family and cheese. Why did I jump? Why did I jump? Why did I jump? I had no reasons to jump there. Well, let's take another branch. Like, it will always happen where I jump here the one time where it's all retreated, but I have no way of knowing. So I'll wait some amount of time. Alright, now that I got an extra hit, I'm gonna be able to survive my drop into nothing. Anytime I come here, there's just nothing. I go there instantly, nothing. I wait, nothing. Putting save state here. Surprise! There's no platform. What a shock. If I go a bit earlier, nope. Alright, well this time I managed to jump onto it though. Like, isn't that insane? Like, put some- maybe there's an indication, but you need to wait to see it? But in that case, how would I know that there is an indication? I... that is such a strange oversight, considering the polish that went into, like, everything else, but... I mean, ah, tell it, man. Just die, please. Ugh. Know, what am I doing now? Right, this part. Well, I sure boned that one up. You can tell I'm... I checked out. Uh, Alright, this time we're not going on Sky Deck. We're gonna go on Banana Bread. Sure, engine room. Why not? Might be some sweet mechanical pieces there. It's still an auto scroll. Oh. Of course. I still say music. I mean, that's just the music of the inside of the ship. So, like, did you feel that you absolutely needed some kind of final auto scroller? Because that's a take. That was just pure luck. Sweet. Like, oh, well, there's Dagadon that I was advertised. Imagine beating the whole level, including all three, like, extra branches to get one one up. All in one life. It's worth it. Uh, am I safe here? Wait, uh, I... Mm. Well, there's a door. Okay, so that one felt a lot easier than whatever it was in Skyrim. It felt a lot shorter, if anything. Maybe it's, like, harder but shorter, and then I just... You know what? I got a little castle that popped up here. Wow, I got the secret exit! This is the only thing I'm getting. I got to final Resnor. I was one Resnor away. I played for way too long. Look. Okay, like, imagine that I went to your place because of your world-famous wizard burger. Like, it's real good. I can tell you paid a lot of attention to the meat, the seasoning, the buns, everything. Not a pretty big guy, so you know I take two. And, you know, once I'm, like, halfway done my first one, you go ahead and just serve me two more. And I get my second burger, and then I get an extra three more added. And then I can see it in your eyes that you expect me to finish every single one of these one-pound wizard burgers. Like, they might be the best thing in the universe, but at some point, I'm 
gonna wish to explode or something. And it's gonna happen regardless. And you gotta be careful about this, you know? Anyway, this is three years ago. 